I'm Mary Huddleston, the 2015 President of the National Association for Healthcare Quality. And I'm Stephanie Mercado, NICU's Executive Director. As healthcare quality professionals, we work in an environment that's constantly changing. That means our own needs often change, and that's where NACU steps in, supporting us throughout our careers. At NACU, we're so proud of the work healthcare quality professionals do, and we take great pride in being there for you. As the only organization committed to the profession of healthcare quality, we want you to consider NACU your professional home. Being home supports and nurtures you. It pushes you to achieve greater success. It defines you. At NACU, we're working hard to be the place that you call home. Here's how. If you're new to the field of healthcare quality or a seasoned pro, enhancing your knowledge and improving your skills is critical to your success. In 2015, many of you, both members and customers alike, turned to NACU to support your professional development. And although we did not host an annual conference in 2015, NACU offered more education than ever before. We offered learning labs and webinars presented by corporate partners. We hosted a National Quality Summit in Philadelphia, and we continued to offer complimentary continuing education through our peer-reviewed publication, the Journal for Healthcare Quality. As a matter of fact, because of our expanded programs and their increasingly relevant content, 50% more people engaged with us in 2015 than in previous years, and we expect that to double in 2016. Seeing the increased engagement is incredibly exciting for us, and with the return of NACU Next, our annual conference in 2017, we look forward to engaging with even more of you at the only event designed exclusively for the healthcare quality profession. Registration for the masses will open in early 2017, but NACU members only will have access to the NACU Next presale, which offers even deeper discounts for signing up early. Stay tuned for future communications with more information, and please join me, the NACU board, and healthcare quality leaders from across the country when we meet in Cincinnati next September. As your professional home, we care about your success, and it's important to us that you receive the recognition you deserve. Getting recognition starts with demonstrating your knowledge of healthcare quality and continues as you master your craft. One of the most important ways to receive recognition as a healthcare quality professional is by earning the CPHQ, the profession's only accredited certification. In 2015, the number of individuals with CPHQs surpassed 9,000, and we expect it to reach 10,000 in 2017. Although CPHQ is the gold standard, we know those new to healthcare quality might not be ready for the CPHQ. And for that reason, NACU recently launched the HQ Principles Certificate Program. This online certificate program provides core knowledge of healthcare quality and is great for individuals and healthcare systems looking to standardize their knowledge base. Additionally, our HQ Essentials is a framework that defines advanced competencies in six areas of healthcare quality. As quality professionals, we want everyone in our professional environment to understand how their job function supports quality. That said, we know that quality professionals are uniquely qualified to lead as new healthcare models emerge. At the heart of a quality professional is a passion to reduce waste and improve outcomes. And now, more than any other time before, we have an opportunity to put our skills and talents to work so that others learn what we already know. The quality professional is an indispensable element in the healthcare leadership team. Not only have we experienced growth with our CPHQs, we welcomed more of you to NACU and performed well financially. Fueled by increased engagement rate in our educational offerings, increased CPHQ certification, and a 7% net growth in membership, NACU achieved a small profit in 2015. And we have set our sights even higher. In the future, we want even more quality professionals to call NACU home. To do that, NACU must continue to perform well financially and to self-fund new programs that keep our members relevant in the face of tremendous and ongoing change. 
NICU aims to keep fees low today, but we must balance that goal with the future goal for growth as we support even more quality professionals. As with any membership organization, volunteers are the lifeblood and a secret to our success. We could not accomplish our goals without the many healthcare quality leaders who have given their time and shared their expertise on our volunteer teams. Their work helps elevate NACU's visibility and credibility as an industry leader. It's been my privilege to work with the NACU board and to support these leaders and other volunteers as they advance the profession. I've worked in healthcare membership organizations for more than 15 years now. And while this is a turbulent time, it's exciting too. I believe that the sky is the limit for quality professionals and that you are well served with NACU as your professional home. And I've been honored to be the president of NACU. I've been a NACU member for 24 years, and I can't imagine keeping up with the tremendous amount of changes without NACU by my side. The education, the certification, and the professional peer connections I've made have supported me throughout my career and made my experience as a quality professional even more meaningful. I urge you to stay committed to NACU if you are a longtime member, to get involved with NACU if you are a new member, and to join NACU if you haven't become a member yet. Now is the time for quality professionals to partner with NACU. For the past 40 years, NACU has been home to thousands of quality professionals, and we look forward to working with you to impact healthcare for the next 40 years. Visit NACU.org to get involved.